Uh, hello everyone. In this video, we will see how we can uh, schedule an AWS service using EventBridge. I'm um, right now in an AWS portal. I'm going to click Amazon EventBridge. So I'm going to create a rule for this one. So create rule. I'm going to give a name for this rule. That is schedule AWS service service um, default. Then I'm going to click schedule click on next so you can give a fine grade uh, cron type syntax you can give or you can give a schedule I am going to give a schedule here which is going to run for every one minute click on next so now I, now I need to select the targets so I'm going to use AWS service as a target here so here I can use a step function uh, you can uh, look for step function state machine <coughs> So you can select any uh, any of the state machine which you have uh, defined in your uh, AWS console. So I'm using a map test here. Uh, if you want to give any additional parameter to the uh, step function, you can mention that in the additional settings. For example, in my case, I want to give pass a parameter to my step function. So I'm going to use constant JSON text, and this is my parameter. I'm going to pass it to my uh, step function. Once that is done, click on next click on next I am going to uh, create I'm going to click create rule so my step function is schedule now which is uh, going to uh, run after every minute so I'm going to go into uh, <coughs> my step function and see whether my step function got triggered or not I have just configured for this map test I'm gonna check this one right now. I'm in step function. I can could see my uh, step function got triggered now. If you see here, this April 17, this is my previous day run, and see if all these are like my today's run, which happened every minute 38, uh, then this 38, uh, 530, 59, 539. Check again now. Let's see 540. So now let's keep on executing. Okay, for every minute it is get triggered and this is executing now uh, that's it for this video uh, thanks for watching